All right, here we go. Big Daddy Shin, day 348 at 24 Fitness. So, yeah, today was a kind of weird day. I'm, uh, well, everything's a weird day, right? But I'm going to a different 24 Hour Fitness because I had to travel a lot. So tomorrow I'm supposed to go hang out with the girls for some luncheon. And then it's like there's ugly sweater contest, but, but, uh, I decided to go against that and I'm just going to just get them something. So I'm going to make them like name tags. But, uh, one of the things I need to do is get these like gold chain things from Michaels and it wasn't there. I don't know. Long story, whatever. Anyways, let me check in right here and we'll figure it out. Awesome. Okay. So I was going to go to like a, go work out earlier, but I didn't. Now there's a reason why. So I got I got really good sleep. I think I slept for like seven hours. I was trying to go for more, but I just I just couldn't get myself to do to it. And so I woke up. I made some chili. So I had this, you know, just beef and vegetables today. A lot of garlic. And then I turn on TV. It turns out that they're having a good times, uh, good times like marathon or something. I don't know if you guys know what Good Times is, but it's like one of the greatest shows ever in the history of TV shows. So, let me get on this bike. Now I remember this place. All right. All right, so it's one of these ones. I hate these ones, I really do. Oh gosh, okay, this one is horrible. Okay, let's see if this one's better. Okay, it's more smooth. The other one was like crooked. Gosh, I don't even know. Manual. And then, okay. Enter. Time. Sixty. Okay. Enter. Wait. Two. Seventy. Four. Okay. Enter age. Forty. Eight. Okay. All right. There we go. It's gonna be like for whatever. I don't even know why I even do this because it's down here. Anyways, let me flip it. All right, there you go. Three, two, one. Okay, so I know that there's nothing really monumental for me to talk about today except how great the show Good Times is. Okay, so if you guys don't know what Good Times is, it's about a family that's that's uh, living in the ghetto of Chicago, right? I mean, that's how I learned the word ghetto from the uh, show Good Times. Good Times also has probably one of the best title songs ever. I mean, that one or Jefferson's. But Good Times is Good Times, Good Times, right? And then uh, Jefferson's, we're well, moving on up, right? But anyway, so what happened is I didn't, I didn't realize how awesome of an actor John Amos is. You know, he's like, you know, the, the dad and coming to America. But he's in a lot of stuff. But, you know, and then Esther Rowe, the mom, she's amazing. And then JJ, Thelma, and uh, Michael, right? I didn't see any Penny ones. I mean, I'm alone in there. But what happens is, is weird because in these, like the way it's written, it's like things happen and all of a sudden something totally unrelated turns out to be the storyline. Right? And then, so some of the things are funny. Some of them are sad. Some of them are like touching emotional. I'm like, oh my gosh. So I'm like laughing, almost crying. I'm like, wow, I couldn't believe. And then some of the things that they were just touching. Right? So it's like, you know, when the, the dad, like his dad gets found, you know, and then, you know, he was like a whole reuniting thing and stuff. And then I'm like, oh man. I mean, it's, it's, and then, you know, it turns out later that something's wrong with the dad. I'm like, wow, you would have never saw it. And they had live studio audience so you could actually hear their reactions. But it's, 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 it's kind of an amazing show. And yeah, the thing is, when I was younger, okay, I mean, I like the show because, you know, you want to see, you know, JJ do his, do his stuff. Like, oh, hey, hey, hey. No, no, that's, that's, that's Dwayne. 
but you know, uh, JJ is like hit dynamite, right? He's a really awesome painter. But the issues that you see that they tackled, so Norman Lear, he was the one that um, created it. He did All in the Family, Jefferson's. I mean, they, they hit a lot of topics. I'm thinking, gosh, I don't know if that would fly in like today's day and age. But yeah, just the seriousness of the stuff, like, you know, like today, one of them, I was going to come earlier, but then JJ was getting married. Like, oh, wow. And he's getting ready to elope with this chick. Turns out that she's a kleptomaniac. The reason why she's stealing a lot of stuff is because she has to support her drug habit. And I go, oh my gosh. You know, I mean, I would have never seen that coming. Sorry, spoiler alert, right? But it's, uh, yeah. I mean, it's just, it's just the way that those writers play with your emotions. I realize Good Time is probably one of the greatest shows ever written. So if you ever get a chance to see Good Times, yeah. But I, yeah, I was going to try and work out like at 12 today, you know. And then Jill, she's like, hey, let's go watch a movie. Okay, awesome. What time are you going to watch it? 9.20? Oh, that's plenty of time, right? No, I've been watching Good Times till about like 4.30. And I'm like, oh. And then I still had to go to Michael's, and then I'm going to make those things for the girls tomorrow, so I don't know when that's going to happen. But, you know, I had to go to a couple different Michael's because they didn't have a certain thing. And then now I'm at the gym, and it's like 6.30. So I'm going to be on this bike for another hour, so that's 7.30, go home, change, shower. No real time to go work on that stuff, and then go watch the movie. And later on, come back and do the stuff, and hopefully the stuff dries by tomorrow morning or we'll see but I'm I'm pretty excited because thing is a lot of you guys don't know my artistic side I have a pretty good artistic side so now I'm trying to figure out okay am I gonna do like my artistic lettering or do I just go straight out like font like I don't know do like a Beauty and the Beast font or something I don't know. So I've been mean, asking their colors. They don't know why. So I'm going to paint their things their colors. So you know what? I think tonight, I don't think I'm going to live stream it because it'll be really boring. I'm just going to be doing this drawing it. Plus, then you guys are going to watch it anyway. I don't even think you're watching this video. But um, yeah, I'll probably just record me doing it and uh, we'll see. So now, right now, I'm trying to think, okay, am I going to put flowers in the background? Am I going to put like sparkling things, what am I going to do? But it's going to be pretty amazing. Good times, good times. But yeah, I'm going to go back to like, I'm going to find, I'm going to find the, the series on somewhere. I don't know, I canceled my Netflix. I have Vader TV. That thing's pretty good. But, uh, uh. Yeah, just watching all those good time episodes. It's pretty awesome. So, anyways, we'll see what happens. In the meantime, yeah, I'm not that hungry. Just need more water. But I realize that it's more just the taste buds in my mouth. That's what I have to figure. So once I could get the whole taste bud thing, so maybe I gotta like carry around mints or something. They carry around mouthwash. But, uh, um, yeah, after eating the cream barbecue yesterday, I realized I don't think it's the actual eating of the food that, that, that I'm addicted to. It's just the taste of it. And then if there's still, if I don't feel that messed up feeling of being overstuffed, then, you know, I'll still eat more. But I think if my taste buds are satiated, saturated, then, okay, I'll figure it out. Anyways, that's about it. I gotta go uh, text some people, figure things out. So here I am, Clash Clash Clan shirt, awesome. Okay, I'm super pissed. I forgot to adjust this thing. That's why 45 minutes are not even seven miles. So I don't know. I guess I'll do the hour and then keep going till I get 10. All right. Okay, so right here. That's a like two minutes 16, but then that's how far it went. So I mean, that went 62 minutes on here, but it's level one. But I'm sweating like crazy. So this was actually pretty beneficial. So the good thing is Estella and Lily, they called me from uh, Mexico. 
So I was talking to them for a while and everything. So that's pretty cool. And then uh, my Spanish is getting pretty good. Yes. So uh, yeah, porque cuando en el video del teléfono, yeah, hablamos mucho. And then uh, you know, yo dije las cosas en mi vida ahorita en la vacación ellos. Uh, tienen vacación en Puerto Vallarta y yo yo hago nada esta vacación well except hang out with my family yes almost there almost there uh. but anyways yeah I miss Mexico I want to go but it's like yeah to get a last minute trip over there horrible I mean, if they live, like, close to Tijuana, then yeah, but then they're, like, a nine-hour drive. Once you get into Mexico, it's a nine-hour drive, so that means it'd be, like, a 10 or 11-hour drive. I'm like, oh, gosh, no way. No manches, right? But then the flights there would probably be, like, 300 bucks right now. I'm like, that's just way too much right now. I can't do that. So, almost there. My sweat's going. And uh, good times, right? Good times. Come on, so 64 minutes. There we go, we're done. All right, there we go. Day 348 in the books. So, you know, plus times. Thinking about watching that movie, Good Times. Or TV show, Good Times. And yeah, it is good times, right? Go in, I mean, yeah, it sucked that I did the whole, you know, one, level one, and then got the whole sweat. So I should have been out of here earlier, but I gotta go and uh, get ready and stuff. So we'll see. See you later. All right. So I have to uh, um, go shower and see you later. Oh, thanks. So once I do that, it'll be fine. Go see Jill, go watch the movie. Mary Poppins. I don't even remember. I mean, yeah, I did see the original one, of course. But I have no idea what this next one is. I heard it's supposed to be some type of sequel or something. But, uh, yeah, that's how it is. But anyways, I'm just going to end it right here, right? So, the Big Daddy Chin. Day 348. If I could exercise 348 days in a row, you could exercise 348 days. Eight days in a row. Because if I could do it, you could do it. And I'm doing it. Having good times. Good times. Anytime in the gym. Good times. Okay. Horrible. I was going to joke and say I'm not a singer, but I am a singer. So what am I supposed to do? I got to learn the words. But that song's one happy happening song. So anyways, off. I'm going to go off. So I will see you next time.